In the top tier, we have Advanced Persistent Threats, also known as APTs, or nation states. As the name suggests, these threats are advanced. APTs are usually organized and well-funded. They tend to take a low and slow approach and are very skilled at operating under the radar. Instead of casting a wide net, they go after high-value targets that are carefully chosen and researched. Nation states are typically more around espionage and intellectual property theft, uh, helping to develop their own economy, stealing trade secrets, stealing counterintelligence secrets. A politically motivated attacker, totally different situation, right? They're not necessarily financially motivated. You're going to have to think about what are the things that are important to that political motivation and what is sensitive in my environment that could be disrupted for their end. They're a government organization, they're a military, they're an entity that follows some sort of organized standard. More advanced actors are gonna be stealthy. You know, you hear advanced persistent threat as APT, legitimately meaning, hey, they're pretty sophisticated and they're not messing around, just throwing stuff against the wall to see what sticks. <laughs>